So that's Saturday morning, fixing problems. Back to me problem problematic um, TGV tellers. And I've stripped it down and I've just um, found a dry joint. Because this has got two operating ends. I've done the other end and I've checked it and I thought it was the other end recently on re previous videos but the actual problem was on the main drive car. I think I had a problem on the other end as well, tell you the truth, but there was a dry joint on one of the pickups and hard to tell a, jar, a dry joint unless you start poking around and it starts flaking. Hopefully this will work now perfectly. Right, also doing some maintenance on <clears throat> the bogey, so if you want to change the traction tyres, etc, to get the wheel sets out, you've got to carefully prise off those little lugs on the, there's four, there's two, four, six, eight lugs, and you've got to carefully prise the front ones off first, and it'll lift off on the front, and then maybe one little lug on this end, and it'll pull off. You can see those lugs. on the bogey section. Got to carefully, just carefully prise, just ease these ones back a bit. These two at either end and it'll just, eventually it'll just pull off. When you get access to all the drive mech, and the wheel sets and the uh, contacts. Uh, so there we go, there's the, the wheel sets. Can see that. Quite worn that but still works alright but my goal here is to get to uh, the contacts because I've got a problem with one of the contacts on there so there's not enough flex on one of these I need to put more flex on it that's another thing I need to do. So I'm just going to pull the other wheel set off very carefully. There we go. You can see uh, it's very easily maintained this model. There we go, you can see all the gubbins. that the front pickups need more flex plus there's a lot of gunge in there yeah, so I'm just gonna flex
ですね I'm just going to put this back now very carefully. Just making sure the contacts are correct. Pops out the other side. Right, they're all in now. All the contacts are in. Just double check. It's looking good. Straighten it up again. And all we do then is make sure the wheel sets are in nice. Cogs are lined up, and all we do then is you get the uh, bogey, the under bogey section. Make sure it's lined up correctly. And just get that into position. Push down. That's it. That's it on there. So now I've done the dry joints and adjusted. Pickups. Alright, so that's good. Right, so I think this model is now 100% working perfect because uh, I've done the dry joints because I found another two dry joints on the model and took the bogey apart. And what I've done is flexed outwards the pickups on the bogey that where it wasn't that was another problem as well it's like where the pickups have were uh, lost the flex and the pressure on the inside of the wheel and yeah take the bogey apart it's easy enough reflex the contacts clean up and now it's uh working beautifully at slow speed really nice overall this because before it had stall coming over these uh, this junction here that's all looking good or oh, it had stall as well coming over the other end of the uh, drive car would um, stall about here that's all perfect now yes yeah, so I'm really happy about that now so another job done let's pick up the speed All done. Yeah, thanks for watching again.